Now's the chance to try out my new bow. Excuse me. It's a skeleton smith, you know? That little fuck is attacking me. Yes, my lord. You tell me every day. Oh, you are going to get fucked. How dare they? He actually shot me in the arm. Who is this fucking douchebag? Well, he's getting fucked now. He's got really good stuff. Diplomatic status. This is a special person of diplomatic importance. Look, I'll bandage him up after I steal from him. What a jerk. He's a pretty good fighter. At least. We'll say that much. So, and do they hate me now? The United Cities? Let's see. No, they don't care that much. Well, you're getting fucking robbed. Sorry to say. Ooh, Edgewalker. Black and chain shirt, don't mind if I do. The clothing I don't think is very great either. So, I'll leave it on him. You'd steal from the law? Well, you're fucking toast, brother. Wonder if, um, let's see. So I'm at two with the United Cities. If I, if I first stayed this loser, do I get bonus points? That's how it works with the other guys. Let's see. It went up to three. Dude, this noble captain had 80 fucking attack. What's this guy got? Oh, he's just got trash. Okay. Cool little diversion. Don't think anyone else got super fucked. We got pretty fucked. Cat also, as per usual, got fucked. I really need to uh, swap out Cat's backpack. At some point. Yeah, Packmaster literally. Okay. I'm going to trade with Packmaster. This, this no dodging meta. I mean, it's probably great for toughness training, but very bad for uh, other types of training. You know? So I'm just gonna... Bad for the martial arts training, I should say. Alright, Cat's Dodge is now mostly cool. Lovely. Could probably store the tools in this guy as well. I wanted to check out this uh, farm. Or the slave market. Just to see what it's about. I mean, probably pretty clear what it's about. I don't know. I don't think I've ever like been here before. Don't think they're going to attack me on site. Yeah, no, they're fine. Don't think they're aware of my transgressions. Be cool to uh, just check this place out. Got a lot of like farms and stuff. Guess I'll send Mr. Torben. Oh, this is a public place, right? Yeah. The gate says it's public. Fresh unused slaves. I'm pretty sure uh, when you buy slaves in this game, you just like release them into the wild. Uh, as long as it's not like a generic NPC. Okay, so they don't have any robots. I think if it's a generic NPC, they'll join the faction, so I don't want to do that. <laughs> oh my god. It's a little smiley face. That's hilarious. Um, let's see. I'm just a bunch of, like, losers. Oh, there's another slave shop. Let's see, there's a lot of just hivers. Mortez. It's got a funny looking face. No robots, though. What's this? Used clothing shop. I wonder, wonder who is the previous owners. <laughs> Let's see. So there's a slave. Uh, just you wait till I finish this grog. I'll be your face blue, slave. Her tin fist been cooking up a storm in the main camp these last few weeks. Drink up, slave. I am made of sake. And then there's citizens. So why have you bought a slave into the bar, Garrett? God, they're just ragging on these guys. Treating them to a drink. He's worked hard this week. And a happy slave makes a good slave. 
Look at his little face. He's loving it. True. Okay, and there's just a hive swordsman who's in this bar. God damn it, Garrett. A bar ain't for the slaves. Feed them sake and they ain't gonna respect you. Gotta keep them on their toes. Give them a few lashings, not sakes. Seems like a slave lover's words, if you ask me. <laughs> Slavery's just their whole thing. Here. What's this? A noble house. Smash slave lover. Who said slave lover? Are they gonna fight now? Keep your voice down, would you? I know, slave lover. This one's just having a drink while he carries my baggage, that's all. Keep it. Take it easy. Oh, and there's a guy called Headshot. That's gotta be a very good, uh, archer. Like, turret person. However, there's no turret person greater than a skeleton turret person that I don't have to fucking micromanage and feed all the time. I wonder if I could beat up dudes from like another faction or something and then like drop them in front of this place. They take them in, right? Could I like recruit people from other factions that way? This place is called Eye Socket. It's an interesting name. Well, if I encounter any assholes, maybe I'll try it out. We'll deal with the United Cities soon enough. They seem pretty tough. So far. Very scary. God, I'm still hung up about that, like, samurai guard. Having, like, fucking 90 attack or some shit. It's like Valamon status. It's a lot of tough motherfuckers. In this game. Don't think there's anyone cool to hire in the way station. We'll double check that as well. Oh, sweet. I can sell that dude's shit. Lovely. Black and chain shirt. That's not too bad. Let's see. So my masterwork lower turtleneck is uh, 21 right, 21 versus... 173860. Wait, it's only 60? Is only 10% more like effective and it's got less blunt resist? I mean, it is. It's special. It's not masterwork, but that's kind of a. Uh, you know. Not as better as I would have hoped. And we have returned. Magnificent. Looks like Molly is finished with all the helmets as well. Which is cool. Oh yeah, I got a tip in the comments from Sandwich, I think. I believe it was the comments. Might be the, um, the other thing. The Discord. To have Gecko have a bigger backpack. Uh, because that is potentially the, like, reason... That gecko has been having a hard time. Is getting stuck. Do we have a bigger backpack available? I know Ruka's got a pretty big one. Looks like the scavenger's backpack. Does it as well. Oh, Meow's got a thieves backpack. That should be big enough. Or yeah, gecko can trade with Meow. So I could potentially start having gecko just mass producing stuff. Where is we? Here is we. We was apparently sleeping. You have a new job, we. You're gonna be. You're gonna be the hemp and booze meister. Now, obviously, those jobs are currently taken, but even still, that can be your job, because they're only intermittently being taken. There will be much rejoicing. Uh, is there? Yeah, we can take the. The wooden backpack. There we go. So, Weed's gonna be a permanent addition to the home squad. I kind of want Kraut 2 as well. But I'm not 100% sure. Also, Lord Destruction. Hackmaster. As strong as they are. Want them to be guarding the base. I mean, Crowd has got literally 
like 50s in attack and defense, right? So he's sort of, he's tough enough to be in the main squad and we are kind of like dude lacking a little bit. So where are these helmets? Here they are, beautiful. So I'll just swap those out real quick. Save you guys the watching that happen. Wait, this thing's got more cut resistance efficiency than this helmet too? Dude, this fucking helmet is so godlike. We even have a couple to spare. Lovely. Let's see the squad's new look. Oh yeah. They look like total badasses. Clearly. Totally sensible look. Fuck, does Griffin at least look okay? At least with Griffin, the color of the armor matches a little bit. Oh my god. Well, that's kind of scary, actually. Just seeing that, like, thousand-yard stare inside the crab-shaped helmet. Dude, I'm so pogged. It even protects against burning and dust storms. It's so fucking cool. Cat is... Uh, keeping his, like, a uh, normal helmet because uh, he uses the crossbow, so there's a certain amount of, like, perception that he's going to want to have. I kind of think it, we should probably revisit Cat's outfit very slightly because it's kind of um, extremely mediocre. First of all, Cat probably needs a leather masterwork turtleneck and a kraut uh, probably needs the same thing in fact uh, pretty much everyone in the main squad needs to have a masterwork grade on because there's no excuse not to because I have so many masterworks now it's part of the reason I wanted uh, Molly to be just mass producing these turtlenecks God, we need to, like, take a trip to, uh, Shacklands or something just to sell these fucking spare shirts. We can't wear a normal shirt, so no reason to equip him either. Or, well, I couldn't even if I wanted to. So that's all that handled. Uh, who's got Mr. Krabs? Kang does. Put the crab down, Kang. It needs to stretch. Oh yeah, it's going to get food. It can survive on a diet of meat wraps now. Which would be cool. Oh man, I should put another feeder over here as well. Oh, we're almost full on hashish. Let's fucking go. Everyone probably should rest a little while as well. So I'll just get that rolling. Oh, Crown needs... Crown needs not dog shit armor for the rest of his kit too. Let's just get that settled. Man, I really should mass produce the normal samurai armor, just so that I can get it set up. Oh no, is that the last of the samurai armor? Guess I'll get another one of those queued up. Could maybe try having Kraut in the crab armor too. What's its cut resistance efficiency? 90%? It's got like universal coverage. I mean, it'd be pretty cool. Yeah, I think I will. I'll make one as well. Well, now that everybody is rested up, I think it's time we tr try out our newfound power on the Holy Nation. Also, who's going to use the, the Mato longsword? Maybe Kraut could be like a longsword main, could potentially, or a saber main, I should say. I mean, normal sabers don't actually have a bad of stats, or are better than a longsword, right? But, I mean, this is a Mato. Yeah, fuck it. Kraut, you're getting the Mato. The Mato longsword. Take good care of it. It will be your weapon for all time. Come to think of it, uh, the rest of my squad has some replacement weapons they need to equip as well. Even though it will most certainly slow them the fuck down. So Griffin, of course, is going to get the Paladin's Cross. Magnificent. We're geared up. Ready to rumble. I guess the first place to try it out would be a holy mine. It's kind of like a low power place. 
but I don't necessarily want to go all the way across the river. I think my assault is gonna go like up and around through Bad Teeth. Bad Teeth will probably be my like first target, my first city that I want to take down. We're gonna need to build up a base nearby just so that I can heal in between assaulting waves though, because I don't think I'll be able to get it just like in one go. Ah, oh, some of these paladins are fucked up already. Wonder what's going on with that? Can cat assassinate this guy? No. Yeah, you're getting fucked, buddy. Don't raise the alarm. Alarm has been raised. Let's see, we're doing like a huge amount of damage, like 80 damage to these lads. Uh, hold up. 23 plus 9 is 32. 32 plus 45. Yeah, that's really fucking good. In, in return, we're taking 11 damage per swing. That's absolutely a tragedy. Did I already take this place out? There's no way, right? I just took this place out and forgot. Does that have a... Wouldn't I have Holy Nation Slaves or something? Join my inventory? Yeah, come on out. I'm not fighting you indoors. Hey, dead woman! That's disrespectful. Ooh, High Overseer. Oh, we teleported him. Dude, what a fucking loser. Yeah, you're not getting first stated. Sorry, bud. Your wounds confess her for eternity. Oh, you know what we could actually do? We could probably put these guys in the jail. Seductress, control yourself. Arrest her. Yeah, let's put these guys in their own jail cells. Can I not? Oh, okay. I can't. Oh, there's a dude in this one. Okay. <laughs> Better put them down if you want to live. Hey! You're all going in the jail cells. Enjoy your new life. Oh no, he lost a leg. Doesn't even need to go in the jail cell now. Who's in the cell? How come I can't see them? What's going on with that one? Is it just locked? Oh, maybe it is just... Maybe someone else owns those cells. That's what it's gotta be. Yeah, this was incredibly easy. I have a feeling that... We do indeed have the power. Power to fight the Holy Nation here. There's one last dude. One last holdout. Cat's going crazy, but the guy's guard is too high. Whatever. I don't care if this guy's on the loose, because he's not going to be first aiding. Is this place count as dead now? No, it's still going. What a wonderful and intoxicating case taste of the power. I think we can just like take out another one too. Without even resting. I think I will do that. What's up, buddies? Poor guys don't even see us coming. Mustn't get away. We're coming to you, buddy. Yeah, negative 53 HP. Not a good sign for you. Probably toast. Oh, here's another lad. <laughs> Let's jump him. Teptris, you'll pay dearly for that, soy. Oh! Oh, there's a ton of servants here. I 
They keep calling me a thief. It's kind of rude of them. I accidentally entrap myself. Like a dumb fuck. I can't believe I've done this. Oh, there's another high overseer. Guess there's one per, like, mine. Dude, cat's animations are going fucking crazy. Just keeps going for the, like, super jump attack. It's so badass. Get him. Get him with the flying. Oh, you need him in the face. Let's go. Oh, there's just more lads. Or, uh, there's no one left in this one. There's just more, uh, prisoners. I mean, probably should save some of them. I'm a little bit worried that they're all going to try to join my team. I guess I could just, like, dismiss them or whatever. I want to only have, like, cool teammates. Okay. Have to be like this tall to join my squad. Oh, what? You're medicking the slaver? How dare you? You lost med medic privileges. In fact, you're going into the neighboring cell. Get fucked. Oh, Soto has become fused to the wall as well. Tragic fate. Is there anything in these containers? Nah. They're empty. Oh, what a jackass. Trying to hit me with that friggin' turret. Alright. Chest minus 94. My man is most certainly dead. Now let's free these guys. Great, now my shackles. Just have to do everything, apparently. It really pisses me off when they're like super ungrateful. I don't have to free these guys. Freedom! Amazing. They're always so incredulous that I can get the shackles too. Escapee? Oh no. Alright, that man's dead. Oh, I see they all bandaged up. Extremely not great. Okay, is there anyone in uh, in here? Oh, there's a dude resting. Don't think I see any more jail cells though. <laughs> Over here, they've broken out. Have bigger fish to fry than that. Sorry to say, buddy never had me. You never had your car. Let's fucking get out of here. Oh, how long is this stuck again? Dude, this place is so glitchy. We can return back home. Maybe I'll pop by the other holy mines real quick. My army of freed slaves. Lead them to great paradise. Okay. Two of them have joined. Hmm... I don't know. I'll hold on to him for now. We did it. We're free. Oh, one of them did come back up. Grass is grass now. Destroy them with fire. Wait, there's, there's serpents up here. How did I not see them last time? Oh, did they restock this place with dudes? The second I, like, friggin' left? They must have had, like, a patrol or something, I guess. For now, these guys can just, uh, join up with the home squad. We're kind of full up on all material components there ever were. So I don't know what exactly they can do. Perhaps they will get kicked out of the gang. In the meantime, 
uh, they'll just uh, be practicing their uh, strength training. We probably also should be doing that as well. Let's get everyone's levels up. I think we did a lot today. A lot for good. Haven't completely destroyed these guys, but it does not matter. Maybe I need to, like, kidnap. I need, like, a jail building. I think that is something I really actually need. So I can, like, kidnap uh, my enemies and uh, torment them. I think a station house probably would be good enough. It's so fucking huge. It's uh, hard to imagine that it would not be good enough. Yeah, look at that. This will be my fucking faction headquarters building. Which is just magnificent. And I'll even have a food store nearby it. Because we have so much like fucking stuff going on. Probably would make sense to have food over here as well. Lovely. You know, uh... These guys can tend to the farms as well. In between bouts of uh, weight training. I think that would be cool. Because some of that shit was unwatered. I think 10 jail cells should be a nice like starting amount. 